Hello, friends, and we'll... I had a mosquito in my eye. Let's start again. Hello, friends, and welcome to a new video. And look what I got here. I got some tadpoles. just decided to cut the grass. That's the noise you're hearing right now. I found these tadpoles in my friend's broken hot tub, so I didn't disturb the wildlife or anything like that. So I'm going to take you on this journey to see the tadpoles transform into adult frogs, and then the best part is that after they transform fully, we could release them. So we came to this pet store to get some tadpole food and this container to put them in. So this is the food that we got for our tadpoles. The best types of water for your tadpoles is pond water and rainwater. You can use tap water only if you use some water conditioner to neutralize all the chemicals in the tap water, like chlorine or iron. So I got my water from a pond that's pretty close to my house. Put some algae, some lily pads, and some other plants. What they like to eat is algae, and sometimes, if there's not a lot of food, other tadpoles. They don't have any legs yet, so we'll have to wait a little longer until their legs develop. So it rained last night and we we're able to collect some water for our tadpoles. They're gonna be so happy. So we moved these tadpoles into a much bigger tank. We put some stepping stones when they transform into real grown-up frogs. They could hop onto these rocks right here and then they could hop out. So when they're adult frogs, they develop lungs and they breathe like us. Now it's time to feed them. So we're going to feed them just a little pinch. They say only five pellets per tadpole. So again, I didn't take these tadpoles and disturb the wildlife. They were in my friend's broken hot tub. So she gave some to us. This one has frog-like features already. See the eyes? He has all the features except for the arms and legs. But he'll be getting on that soon.